Hey guys, Pep Man here at Carolina Varsity. We're going to take a look at another big matchup here. We got Butler coming off the loss to Mallet Creek, traveling up to Western Alamance to play Western Alamance. <laughs> um, keys for victory in this game, I think for Butler, um, there is a receiver for Western Alamance by the name of Jake Christman. Had nine catches for 86 yards and two touchdowns. I think that's the guy you got to stop in the passing game. Um, the quarterback. His uh, last name, Daniels, he's a junior. He was 15-20 last week for 208 yards and two touchdowns. So um, he also looks like a dual-threat guy, nine carries for 72 yards. So you got to be smart um, rushing him and contain him in the pocket. Um, key for Western Alamance, uh, Butler's going to be very upset. Um, they're going to you know, be mad that they let the opportunity to beat Mallard Creek kind of slip away a little bit. Um, probably felt like they should have uh, played better in some facets of that game. Um, Western Alamance is a smaller school than Butler. Um, Butler's going to be, I think, stronger in a lot of places, more talented. Um, so Western Alamance has to execute with precision on both sides of the ball uh, when you're in that kind of situation. And then you got to force turnovers. Um, Butler with a senior quarterback in Davis Cheek. He's uh, pretty intelligent. He threw for over 300 against Mallet Creek, which is very impressive in its own right. So you got a, um, a senior quarterback, a lot of senior leadership on this Butler team that is going to be motivated to come out there and um, try to rectify the uh, wrongs from last week. Um, we're going to have weather in Charlotte. Um, Western Alamance is not too far away, so we're probably going to have that affected up there also, which... Um, you know, I don't know if that really gives Western Alamance a huge advantage because it seems to be like they're more of a uh, spread uh, kind of team themselves. So, um, Western Alamance is 2-0. and uh, They kind of beat down the two guys they played um, in Cummings and Southern Alamance. But this is a big step up for them. And um, it's going to be a, a really big challenge here. Um, Butler is a big favorite probably in, in this game looking at, you know, everything I'm seeing here. Uh, but that's why they play the game. Um, someone mentioned that in a rainstorm last year, you know, Butler lost to East Mech. But Western Alamance is a uh, little bit different build than East Mech is. So um should be a, uh, a good game to watch if you're a Butler fan, uh, Western Alamance people. If you differ, please let me know. Um, I'm always open to hearing other sides of the story. Um, but travel safe if you're going to this one, and I appreciate you watching. Thanks a lot.